just close your eyes Lorna relax I know just what you need just an angry spirit he can't hurt you Go away in a minute. I want my money back! Hello, Mickey. Someone's reported a disturbance at this address, and I'm guessing that it's you. What's this Gina done to you? Well, it's private matter. I'll go, I'll Well, that depends on whether she presses charges. Just keep an eye on him while I talk to the householder. See you next week, Lorna. Gina? Yeah? Sergeant Hollings, Rutherbridge Police. I'd have never guessed. Come in. You've been smoking something? Incense. I'm a wise woman. I'm sure you are, madam. No, what I mean is I'm a witch, a white witch. There's no harm in it. I help people, give them what they need. What kind of thing are we talking about? Spells to make you rich and successful. Cures for impotence, infertility, broken hearts, baldness. I provide a service to the community. I thought that was my job. What did you sell, Mickey? Now, that's confidential be unprofessional to tell you. And what professional association would you be part of? Fellowship with a broomstick? I'm used to people being ignorant. Sorry, Gina, I am trying to help you. Mickey is being threatening. <laughs> Mickey couldn't threaten a fly. He's harmless. So don't you want to tell me what this is all about? You don't need to know. I'm not pressing charges, so there's no crime, is there? I'm sure you've got better things to do. I'll be on my way, then. You're tired, burnt out, fed up. Not even sure you want to do this job. I can help. I can give you something. No, thanks, love. Heston, you can come out now. How did you know I was here? You're not very good at hiding. <sighs> thanks for these. Am I forgiven for spending so much time with the WI instead of you? <laughs> of course you are. Don't be ridiculous. I missed snuggling up to you. It was only one night. Felt like an eternity. At least we can spend this evening together. Heston, you know I'm busy. Well, couldn't we meet up afterwards? We've discussed this. I need time on my own. No further action. She's not bringing charges. You're free to go, but don't let it happen again. Mickey, a word. What's all this about? This is woman. I thought so. The workmates come in most evenings for a drink. She comes with them. She's very shy. So I got talking to her. I, I could tell she was lonely. Cheered her up. She's got this amazing smile. So, um, you know, we got together. Only she's very nervous about all of that. Can't let people close. You know, so I, I just, I just want to be with her. So you thought you'd ask Gina for a magic spell? I know, she's a witch, she told me. No, of course not. I don't believe in all of that rubbish. So why did you go and see her? Well, she gives advice, you know, about relationships and such. So, so I just thought... And I'd... you weren't satisfied with the service? No, there was a misunderstanding over payment, that's all. That had better be all. I don't want any more trouble, all right? Come in. Your next patient cancelled, and uh, this has come for you. Are they designer? No. Oh, there's something about new shoes. Can you put them back, please? They're dead sexy, those. I never would have thought you'd have gone for anything like that. 
Are you on the pool? No, I'm doing something I enjoy. It's relaxing, therapeutic, and it's good for my back muscles. Oh, Heston, um, I'm snowed under. Can it wait? Thank you. Mysterious Thursday nights. No, she hasn't said a word to me. Well, there's nobody outside. What did you actually see? Nothing. I heard someone laughing. Teenagers. And it sounded really close. I don't think anybody can get in. I do think that you're safe. So if you've got any worries, just, just give us a call at the station. <laughs> there's a man pestering me. think no man would be interested in me. No, I don't think that at all. I didn't lead him on. He just won't leave me alone. Do you want to tell me about it? You probably think I'm wasting your time. Well, I won't know until you've told me. I'll tell you what, why don't you give me his name? Mickey Greening. Colleagues gave him my phone number. He rings me up, talks to me, asks me out. Sometimes he's flirty. How often does he ring? Every week. Is he doing anything else, like sending letters or texts, or does he, does he turn up at the house? No. Do you think he might? No, no, I don't think he will, no. But I think you spend too much time on your own, Annie. I think you need to get out more. I can't. I'm agoraphobic. Are you? Oh, I didn't know. But you, you go to work and you go to the pub. Two years ago, I, I had a panic attack down at the bus station, you see, so I couldn't go there again. Then it happened in the supermarket and the park and everywhere else. Two years ago, I couldn't leave the house. I was putting my life back together until Mickey... Do you want to make an official complaint? Oh, no, I don't want to be a nuisance. I'll tell you what, why don't I have a quiet word with Mickey? Tell him to stop. I've asked him. He won't listen. He'll listen to me. <sighs> Thanks. I know you all think I'm neurotic. Oh, thanks for coming. Absolutely. Small world. Careful. It's Mum's best china. Put a sugar in for you. Am I not sweet enough? Sorry, do you want me to make you another? Don't be silly. I've got to go in and see Julia. Tell her what happened. I don't know what to do. Well, everyone makes mistakes. I've nearly killed people loads of times. Not literally, you know what I mean. No one blames you. It wasn't my fault. Michelle made the mistake, and she's blaming me. And Everybody believes her. What? Do you want some green tea? I've got some biscuits. No, that's all right, love. You sit down. Are you two are friends, then? <laughs> Jean is the one who helped me. If it wasn't for her... Oh, it was nothing. You see, staying 